two seasons ago. So this would be my red shirt sophomore year. The indoor Big Tens was my craziest season. It was the first round of the men's weight throw. Lonnie Pugh was my old teammate, and me and Lonnie are kind of the top dogs in the flight. And uh, third round comes up, I take first place. Just broke the school record by a foot. So I'm like, yeah, man, I'm about to get my first ring. You know, I'm happy, I'm excited. Fourth round comes along, Lonnie Pugh takes the lead. He jumps me by six inches. So I'm like, man, all right, I gotta get back in this. And uh, fifth round comes along, and I'm before Lonnie in the, in the standings. So I go 72-6. That's another school record by two feet. And I'm like, man, I can't be defeated now. Like, I already got this ring pictured in my head. I'm about to get sized up when I go back. Lonnie comes up, fifth round, drops a bomb on me, man. Goes 72-10. Man, I didn't know how to feel. I was so bipolar, man. I was happy for my teammate, but I was real disappointed with the loss. But... There was so much emotion going on there, man. Just to take one, two alongside my teammate. I mean, that man taught me how to humble myself, how to work hard, how to have short-term memory when things ain't going your way. You know, how to be just a competitor, really. Lonnie was a competitor. That's what defined Lonnie Pugh, and he helped me make that a part of my character, too.